I left the parking area about 15 minutes ago. It's about quarter to six now. I left the house about four o'clock. I'm gonna do Skidor and a couple more peaks today. It should be about a 10 mile um, walk with about four or five um, summits. So let's get started. This is just a monument for two shepherdsmen that passed away in the 1800s. Um, Edward Howell and Joseph Howell, 1851 and 1891. Looks amazing in the dark. <laughs> See you later. Welcome back. It's um, getting up half past seven. I've been walking for about an hour and a quarter to get up to um, the first peak of the day, which is this one behind me. Um, it's on the way to Skidor and it's called Lesser Man. And then you can't quite see the one just behind it, but that's low, um, Little Man. I'll show you on the map. So this is where I parked. And I walked up there to here. And that's where I am now at that gate there. So I'm going to get up to there and then you drop back down and then back up to Skiddaw. So hopefully by the time we get to the top of there, which does look like it's starting to clear a little bit, I'll bring you back when we get up to there. So we're just coming to the top of our first cairn, which is a lesser man. A lot of old rebar, it looks like a giant game of kaplunk. <laughs> Very strange. A lot of old rebar. Is little man which we're gonna drop down a little bit then climb up to the top of that so I'll bring you in there. Hello just coming to the top of little man second cairn for the day 835 meters new stick skid up is there can't see it. That's 931. So we're going to drop down um, and then climb up to the top of Skidar. See you in a bit. Made it to the top of Skidor in three hours and that includes doing the two smaller hills as well. I'm going to drop down to a waterfall now called Whitewater Dash. I'm hoping it's going to clear up a little bit because the views aren't um, spectacular at the moment. But it has cleared a little bit for me on the top so I can see over the, well a couple of minutes ago I could see over the Solway Firth into Scotland but it's clouded over a little bit more again. It's just coming in and out so anyway we'll um we'll carry on I'll see you later
back on the camera. I haven't done a bit for a while. The weather has been amazing. It's, it's cleared up quite a lot. It's very atmospheric with all the clouds. I'm at the top of Bake Stall now, which is 673 metres, the fourth summit of the day. Probably the last one, I think. Because I'm going to drop right down to the waterfall and then join the Cumbria way, and that takes me all the way back to where the car is. So I'm just going to show you the cairn here. I'm going to stop here and have some lunch. But the views are fantastic. And the weather's it's warmed up quite a lot as well. So I'll see you at the waterfall. Back on the uh, Cumbrian Way, which is we're pretty much where I started on with the car this morning. So I've been out about seven hours now, I think. I think it'll be probably eight, eight and a half by the time I get back to the car. So this might be one of the last bits of, to the camera. I think I think it will be anyway, because it's. I just want to get cracked on and uh, get home, have a nice chill out tonight, and then back to work tomorrow night. But um, you can see where I've pretty much been from this spot because the sun's on the top of Skiddaw at the moment. You can actually see someone on the top. You probably won't be able to pick that up on the camera, but um, I'll just turn the camera around so you can see. So this hill here is Little Man and Lesser Man. Now they're the first two that I did. So I went that one, that one, and then up to the top of Skiddaw, along the ridge to there. I can't remember the name of it now. Breakwell Tart or something I called it, I think. And then down this ridge here to the waterfall, which I'm hoping you've enjoyed the footage of that from the drone. I was a bit nervy <laughs> doing the drone footage up that waterfall. I can't, uh, must say, it was a bit dodgy, but um, I think that was all right. Um, so I'm just going to have a steady walk back to the car and then go home. So, it's been a funny day with the weather, but it's turned out lovely this afternoon. So I hope you've enjoyed it. Um, and if you do enjoy the videos, please just click and subscribe on the channel. Um, it's building up very slowly, but surely, which is good. Um, and thanks very much for watching. And I'll see you on the next one.
Just wanna just gonna dedicate this climb today to my mate Chris from the height of life. He's laid up with a bad back and he'd rather be here, I'm sure, even though the weather's a bit rubbish. Cheers Chris, hope you get well soon mate.